uh, and that's a proposed motion in, of solidarity with uh, Babajan and the Hansa Five. Um, I'll just read out the proposed motion. Um, uh, Babajan and four comrades, all members of the Labour Party of pa Pakistan and the Progressive Youth, Youth Front, have been imprisoned since September last year for standing up for the rights of his people from the Hunza Valley in the remote province of Gilgit, Balistan. Uh, after their villages and farmlands were flooded in 2010, collectively they have been come, to, come to be known as the Hunza Five. They are among the growing number of those who could be termed political prisoners of the global climate crisis. In, in 2010, uh, one-fifth one of, of Pakistan was flooded after extremely heavy monsoonal rains. 2,000 people died as a result of this extreme weather event and 20 million people suffered displacement and or destruction of property, livelihood and infrastructure. Uh, they were arrested for leading pro protests of victims of devastating flooding who had been cheated of compensation and assistance by corrupt officials. The Hunza Five have been assaulted, tortured and denied their rights, including, including visiting rights and medical treatment during their imprisonment. There has been an international campaign of solidarity, and here in Australia, uh, and we organised for numerous letters of protest and concern to be sent to the Pakistani government. This campaign forced the government to allow Babajan and his comrades visits and some medical treatment, which they had previously been denied. Uh, then last month, there was where they were finally about to be granted bail, nine months after they were arrested. When Babajan's lawyer went to the magistrate with the bail application, the public prosecutor said that the magistrate was not allowed to hear this, this case. Uh, uh, this case, the police has now inserted new charges under draconian anti-terrorist laws, and so his case could be heard only by a special anti-terrorist court. On July 19, the joint investigation <coughs> team, consisting of police and, and intelligence officials, came to Jutail Jail, Gilgit, where Babajan was being held in order to take him into their custody. Fearing that the team had not actually obtained judicial uh, remand from the anti-terrorist court, which would authorise them to take custody of Babajan, and further fearing that the intention would be torture, or at least either as a last-ditch attempt to extract a confession from Babajan, or as an evictive expression of their frustration and not being able to break him so far, ordinary prisoners rose up in solidarity with Babajan and resisted the attempts of the team to shift Babajan out of the prison. The team had to give up, but they could return. Babajan's lawyers and comrades are determined to resist any move to hand over custody of Babajan to the police or to the joint investigation team, and will demand that Babajan be questioned by the JRT in Jutiao Jail. His supporters, especially his family, are said to be extremely worried that giving, uh, that giving physical custody of Babajan to the crime police or the JRT will inevitably lead to further torture. Given the two previous instances in October 2011 and April May 2012, and the fact that the Anti-Terrorism Act admits the confessions of the accused as evidence, uh, and that torture is an accepted means of investigation in our law enforcement paradigm, that this is a well-founded fear. Let us not forget that the joint investigation team is composed of police and intelligence agents, that and that it was representatives of the same establishments that abducted and tortured Babajan and his comrades in violation of the judicial remand. The LPP and PYF comrades in Gilgit are unanimous in their support that now that the ruling clique of the region know that their attempts to manipulate the, the judicial system to pressure the Hunza Five have almost failed and are extremely fearful about what will happen when they are at liberty, free to talk their experiences and expose the reality of the collaborationist anti-people elite and the people of Gilgit, Balistan. Accordingly, this Conference of Resistance, a socialist youth organisation in Australia, declares its strongest solidarity with Babajan and his comrades and calls for his immediate release and for all charges to be dropped. Resistance considers the Hunza Five to be prisoners of conscious and political prisoners in the global climate crisis. All those in favour of this motion of solidarity? All those against? That's unanimously carried. Free Babajan! Free Babajan! Free Babajan! Free Babajan! Free Babajan! Free Babajan! Free Babajan!